Hello everyone, I'm your host Josh. Today let's look at the new iteration of the Bravo series. The Bravo series offers great value that makes performance and essential gaming features accessible. It not only comes in two sizes, Bravo 17 and Bravo 15, but also comes in both AMD and Nvidia graphics. You can tell by the code that came after or simply check the listed specifications. For today, we'll be checking out the latest iteration that comes with Ryzen 7 or 5 processor and RTX 4060 and 4050 graphics. These models come with great gaming performance that will not only offer high frame rates in competitive titles, but also game with high settings in AAA titles thanks to the power of frame generation brought by DLSS3 technology. To power all this performance, the Bravo series features Cooler Boost 5. The new shared pipe design runs across both CPU and GPU to further improve thermal capability, keeping the system cool and smooth during intensive battles. Below the cooling module, you'll also find two upgradable M.2 SSD slots and two RAM slots. So, how do they stack up against the previous generation? Starting with CPU. The Ryzen 7000 series brings decent performance gain while doing so at a lower power cost. This will improve system performance while offering better battery life. Moving to GPU, the RTX 40 series is a must in 2023. As you can see, the RTX 4050 can already outrun the 3060, while the 4060 wins by a significant margin. Next, let's see what games you can expect them to run. In Cyberpunk 2077, both graphics can run smoothly at very capable frame rates in the highest presets. If you'd like to experience ray traced effects while making full use of the 144Hz display, we'd suggest enabling DLSS and frame generation and pair with medium settings. In Diablo 4, both graphics will give you optimal results even at the highest possible settings. In the event where you want to run it at an external 240Hz display, try turning on DLSS 3 package and the frame rate will shoot through the roof. Driving for beautiful scenery, RTX 4050 can run with the extreme preset while the 4060 can do so at an even smoother frame rate. If you prioritize buttery smooth action, just slightly drop the setting to high and see it peak triple digits. For gamers, a great gaming keyboard is also essential. The Bravo series comes with 4-zone RGB gaming keyboard that's customizable through MSI Center. If you're not into fancy lighting and would rather save an extra buck for elsewhere, you can also option this for a beautiful futuristic blue backlight. Regardless of the backlight you choose, both of them comes with reinforced backplates and decent travel, plus translucent WASD keys and an enlarged control key and full-size arrow keys. Side note. The Bravo 15 is also amongst only a handful of 15-inch laptops that comes with physical number pad. A huge plus if you're also looking to use this for work. Scanning around the exterior, you'll be happily greeted by a wide range of input-output ports, including audio combo jack, USB 3.2 Gen 1 Type A, USB 3.2 Gen 1 Type C with DP, HDMI 2.1, Ethernet, DC in, another USB 3.2 Gen 1 Type A, and a USB 2.0 Type A. To make full use of your Bravo series, here are some helpful tips that you'll want to know. Out of the box, the laptops are set in MS Hybrid mode, where your graphics stays asleep when not needed to ensure power saving for best mobility. If you'd like to explore all of its full potential, the Bravo series supports discrete graphics mode, or often refers to as a MUX switch. You'll find it within Settings in MSI Center. Navigate to Features to find GPU Switch. Do note this will trade battery life for performance. So remember to switch back if you prioritize the former. The RTX 4060 or 4050 should get you going on most of the games. But what if you want higher frame rates? Here's how you can enable DLSS technology in supported titles. Let's use the latest Diablo 4 as an example. You'll find DLSS under Graphic Settings. Select the level of processing, and don't forget to activate frame generation. There, more FPS for free. In order to allow quick access to a series of functions, we have deployed tons of shortcuts on function keys. For example, if you want to toggle between performance modes, just press function and F7. If you want to cool down the laptop immediately, you can press function and up to launch the cooler boost which will boost the fan speed to the highest, allowing the laptop to cool down as quickly as possible. If you'd like to activate the shortcuts without holding function key, press function and escape for lock function, so the keys default to shortcuts instead of F1 through to F12. 
These are just some of the tips to help you get started. If you'd like to know more, consider checking out this tutorial for MSI Center. All in all, the Bravo series combines decent performance, gaming experience, connectivity, and upgradability, all within an accessible package. If you're looking for a great all-round gaming laptop to start with, you should definitely check this one out. Till next time, Bravo out.